unplug the tractor globe. Okay then. What are we waiting for? Tremor. No, I wasn't paying attention. I hope I imagined it. Indeed. <sighs> if you told me one day I'd be million- Beautiful, isn't it? I'd say- I'm trying to figure out- I'm pretty sure you don't know how nucleosynthesis works either. But That's true. <sighs> yeah. What? Think about it. Imagine the- We would've- And- I don't care about these rocks. All I care about is being with you. Here, in the apiary, in deep space, or at the bottom of a hole. It's all the same to me. It's all decorative. Some decor are a bit nicer than others, though. Yeah, but that's... Uh, what's that phrase you use in sciences? Oh yeah, negligible amounts. Nothing. Okay, okay, beginner's luck. But watch out. It won't last. I had washed my hair this morning. Uh, you are not even letting me take a look. What was that noise? Ugh, my stomach. It needs to be fed soon. Agree this th yeah, it's probably as part of space. I don't know. This? These aren't their blue? Yeah. But <laughs> Ooh. <sighs> you? Uh, you? You? Oh, sorry. These blue? If we ever need a... <sighs> If that doesn't... Not sure about you. Marshmallows. My guitar. You well, where at my well, or I took I I but, uh, but yeah, you 
<laughs> I was thinking more along the lines of the flow. Very. Isn't it? Why not? Bite the rope. <laughs> not bad. Mm. Acrosil. Ten. Feet. <gasps> oh. We are so. We'll bring the house down. I think we have enough rust to plug the tractor blade. Okay then. What are we waiting for? Try drifting next time. It makes faster turns. I feel like she's avoiding us. Can we go back the other way? As you wish. Just trying to take a closer look at you. Seed. Hey. Are you sure they canceled the colonization? Because we've come across a lot of infrastructure at this point. I'm just telling you what I read in the archives. Could it be that the archives are... lying? Hmm. Uh, of course they could be. Keep 
Great job. You're welcome. Phew. What? You know what to do. Yep. Your turn. On it. Done and done. We make a good team. Did I just see that thing eat up a flow thread? Sure did. That's probably why these creatures don't seem affected by the rust. Good for them. But I hope they're sparing some for others. Us, namely. And more rust. You can never have too much. Do we still need rust? Of course. It's always useful. Whoa. I'm not sure what his toy did to him, but I wouldn't like to be in its place. Hold on. Isn't that... What? Let's get a closer look. Doesn't sound like a good idea. Okay. It would seem that he's not gonna share his toy. What did I tell you? Attacks aren't land. Maybe if we both attacked at the same time. Take that! <laughs> He's too impervious. We should coordinate our attacks. On your fist! We should drop them French. You could have waited for me to attack. All set? Now! I think we found the right technique. Ha! I'm sure he felt that. Three, two, one. Go, go, go! You want some more? On your mark. Anytime. Ugh. Oh, brute! Eat it! Ready when you are. Ready! Booyah! Mark. Are you okay? Woo! All set. Now! This one's ready. Yep. Right before the picking. Harvest time. Tip cow. Who's next? Done and done. You left this toy behind. That's not a toy. Looks like... A robot? Almost. It's a Draca. Drone for autonomous cartography. Very old tech. The kind we sent out to beauty before it was integrated to the apiary. Oh. Seems like they pondered integrating Source for a while as well. I wonder why they changed their minds. It could be the fact that this planet is scattered like a puzzle. Probably was a factor. The Draca may hold some answers. You're kidding. No, really. Stuff from that era was built tough. We may be able to boot it back up. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. I might have spoken a bit quickly. The flow circuits are completely fried. But, 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 look at what I was able to salvage. The anti-grav chips don't seem to be damaged. I should be able to make them compatible with our boots by tweaking the connectors a bit. Whoa. Even better, the mapping module is also working perfectly. If I plug that into the glove's power source, it should... Boom! This should be very helpful for finding our way around the bits of land. <laughs> you never cease to impress me. Ah, uh, that's nothing, really. These old machines are plain and simple astronautical engineering. Not like the new stuff with boronic nano components everywhere. So, that way we can map out the different bits? Yeah, and 
And with this, we can make our way back to the nest a lot easier. Hey, look! It says there's another bridge in this area. Perfect. That way we can test if your thingy works. is working. Are you surprised? Been there. Well, yeah, that's where we came from. Come on! What a chicken! This is where we came from, isn't it? Certainly is. Ripe for the picking. Harvest time. We're too slow. Three, two, one. Go, go, go! Oh. Ooh. That looks bad. You? Yep, saw that. One down. One to go. On your mark. Now! <sighs> oh. Don't... <clears throat> Ready when you are. Ready. You know what to do. I'm on it. This one's ready. Yep. Now shoot. <laughs> We're that good. At least we didn't spare any effort. This is weird. What is? It looks like there's also a pre-recorded location on the radar. Hmm. What could it be? I don't know. Little Draca's favorite picnic spot? In that case, we definitely have to check it out. Isn't that Oink? That is definitely him. That's Oink. What's happening, big guy? Why are you here? You missed us, didn't you? I bet he felt lonely on his empty eyelid. You do realize that we can't take you along on our journeys, don't you? That would be too exhausting for you. Shh. 
But you can stay with us next to the nest if you want. <laughs> no funny business, though. So? Well, it fits. That's a good sign. Let's get this ball rolling. What? What? Haven't you heard of that one either? Oh no, I have. It's just a really old-fashioned saying. Let's get this show on the road. Okay, that's worse. Can you just switch on the track to globe, please? <laughs> okay. We just need to fix up the wings, and the turbine, and the hypopropellers, and... Don't be so cynical. Getting the nest out of the crevasse was quite a feat. Huh? No, don't get me wrong. I am genuinely delighted. I love fixing things up. But... I don't think we need to get started right away. <sighs> That's a relief. Mm. This isn't gonna go very far without rust. Come on, give me your boots. Once I plug in these chips, they'll be like a whole new pair. I can barely figure out left and right as they are. I am gonna kill them. I swear I am gonna kill them. Are you sure you don't wanna take a break, get some fresh air? No. These bloating anti-grav chips aren't the boss of me. I still don't understand what the problem is. The problem is, there is such a thing as a standard. And the Borons who designed this drone thought it might be fun to improve this standard. Except, if you take a standard and improve upon it, you get... A better standard? You get no standard at all! <sighs> And so now, it looks like I have to machine these boron chips. Just so they can fit in these bloating boots. Uh, anything I can do to help? No, I'm okay. I'm done. What? But that was super quick. Well, yeah, when you have the right tools. I mean, since you were complaining, I was thinking that it would take a while. It's a matter of principle. Let's go. We'll see if these work outside. Ready to test these bad boys? I guess. What are we doing? Okay, follow the thread as usual, except this time we should be able to make it till the end. That's awesome. 
you've traveled across space, but floating a few feet above the ground is awesome? Uh, awesomeness is very subjective, you. In any case, these boots are working. We should try them with that thread we weren't able to use last time. Do you remember where it was? The mapping module certainly does. All right, give me those medical plants of yours. Time to fire up the synthesizer. With this thing, we'll be right back on our feet. Are you sure you know how? I have a synthesizer in my ship. Of course I know how these work. Uh, no, wait, that's not the way. I know what I'm doing. Really? Because at this stage, you should... Ugh, look, I've always done it this way, and it's always worked out. You're not gonna tell me how to use my own synthesizer. All right, all right, as you wish. I didn't know you could also do it that way. And? Sorry I doubted you. And? Uh, I love you? Okay, that's not what I was expecting, but it'll do. You? Yeah? I see you've brushed your hair in the shower again. How can you tell? It's not draining. Oh, uh, sorry. Improve what, exactly? What are you looking at? Distance between us and the apiary. I wouldn't expect it to change. Exactly. It's comforting. You can open your eyes. Surprise anniversary! Huh? <laughs> I meant to say surprise and then I thought, happy anniversary. I panicked. Whose anniversary is it? It's our anniversary. One month on Source. Already? Yeah. I mean, give or take a few days. I went by fast. Yeah. Remember the time we almost died crashing on this planet? And the time we almost died in an earthquake? Ah, and the time we almost died fighting that critter? I hope this is only the beginning. And that I'll have many more chances to almost die with you. Aren't you a charmer? So, are you gonna open your present? Well, our present. Sure, sure. Uh-huh. What is it? Fermented apple juice. I stuck them in the soaker tub to accelerate the process. I'm calling it Apple Brew. Hmm. Do you think that it's any good? 
Well, worst case scenario, we just wasted some apple juice. No big deal. Should we open it now? We can open it whenever you want. To us. To us. Hey, that's really good, actually. <laughs> that's really strong, too. Do you remember the first time you talked about leaving the apiary? <laughs> of course. I'd had a shouting match with my mom. I was just angry. No, oh, before that. Before? We had landed the nest on a hilltop, we were stargazing, and you said, Come on, let's go. Hmm? I haven't stopped thinking about it since that day. I think that's what pushed me to dig into the Astro Company archives, which led me to find the coordinates of Source. I wanted to be ready for the day. Wait, wait, when was that? I don't remember. Right at the beginning, you and your mom got in a fight, you hopped into the nest at night, and you picked me up at my house. Was that when we went to the uplands? Yes, the uplands, that's it. Oh, <laughs> Flute, I remember. It was in Frozember. It was super cold out. I was freezing, I just wanted to get back into the nest. That's why I said, let's go. <laughs> and since you didn't respond, I thought you wanted to stay outside. So I didn't push it. I actually caught a beast of a cold that night. Wait, so that means if I hadn't misunderstood that night. I wouldn't have caught a cold. No, but wait, you don't realize how deep this goes. That means we would never have known about Source. We would have never come all the way here. We would probably still be stuck in the apiary. Sure, but if I hadn't caught a cold, I would have never been stuck in bed for a week. And you would have never visited me for tea with armloads of homemade cookies. And you would have never hung out with me for hours on end when I look like a ghost. And I wouldn't have fallen in love with you. So who knows? Maybe I would be living happily in the apiary with my mate. Which means that beforehand... We had known each other for like three weeks, Kay. Do you really think that I fell head over heels the first time I saw you? I know I fell head over heels the first time I saw you. Oh, okay. You just like my looks then. <laughs> no, that's not what I meant. You mean you don't like the way I look? I have a feeling there's no right answer. Then don't answer. only for special occasions. Aggressive dish, isn't it? Hmm? Why'd you say that? Well, it's a lot of fat and carbs. You're usually more fine dining. 
Hmm. That's true. There's more if you want. Definitely. 18, 19, 20. Keep on going, my love, you're strong. 21, 22. You know I'm able to count on my own, right? Yeah, but I like to watch when you do push-ups. That way I feel like I'm participating. You could also do push-ups. <laughs> no. No need for that. I am naturally muscular. There's no such thing as naturally muscular. For real? Arm wrestle? <laughs> no. It's a trap. If I win, you'll complain that I hurt your arm. And if I let you in, I'll be hearing about it for weeks. Ding, ding, ding! Win by default. See? Naturally muscular. I'm done. It's all straightened out. Everything's tidy and clean. Besides us, that is. <laughs> yeah, we are kinda stinky. Off to the shower then? Ah, Blute. What is it? I just mobbed the bathroom. Oh. Do you think we can marinate another 10 to 15 minutes in our own filth? <laughs> Honestly, can do. What's this rocky chunk got to say? Well, for starters, it says it's not a rock. Really? It's not living, is it? No. It's not mineral or organic. So, what is it? <laughs> Going straight to the hard questions. But that is not how science works. How does it work, then? First of all, you formulate a hypothesis. Then you build an experiment to test this hypothesis. You observe, and you learn. Okay, then what have you learned? That I'm lacking imagination regarding hypotheses? One thing we know for sure is that rust particles scatter immediately when in contact with flow. I'd like to observe this reaction more closely. You can do that next time. Right now, you should go to bed. Already? What time is it? No idea, but I know I'm sleepy. And I want my snuggles before I crash. <laughs> gotcha. Apple brew is only... Improve what, exactly?
okay? We need to talk. Should I be worried? Yes. No. Maybe. Promise me you won't be mad. I can't promise anything without knowing what this is about. <sighs> it's about your skidding skills. Oh. <laughs> Let's just say that you could use some extra training. <laughs> okay. Show me. You're not mad? Why would I be mad? I love to learn new things. All right. Let's hop on a few threads to practice. Now! You can keep it going. Skid! Skid! Now you have a handle on this. Perfect. I have to say, I have an excellent teacher. Well, you passed the test. Let's get back to business. Who's a good oink? Who's daddy's oink? Who's that? Oh, you are! Yes, you are. Hmm. This isn't gonna go very far without rust. 